All right, yo, what is going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. Now, I just got this new combo. It's a loose tournament reel, and I have a St. Croix Bass Mojo rod on here. I just got this about a week ago, so we're going to be fishing with it today. I haven't caught a fish on it yet. We're out at this pond that you guys have seen me fish a couple times before, so I'm excited. Let's go catch some fish. So I just got this little 5 16 ounce finesse jig on here. It's like a, I don't remember the color, bandito bug on the back. This reel is so nice. I need to get used to it, set it up. All right, so if you guys can see this here, they kind of have these like pipes that go across. I'm not really sure why, but a bunch of duckweed gathers up in here. And I used to just flip jigs in this and these bass would just be sitting all over here. And these bass would just be sitting there. You guys see these giant carp, ginormous grass carp, whatever they are, I'm not sure. We're gonna see if anyone's just chilling in here. Yep. What I say? That's literally what I said. Get him there. He's over. First flip. Get up here. Yes, sir. That was so dirty. That's literally what I just said would happen. That was so sick. Solid one. Let's go, baby. All right, let's go ahead and pop this jig out. Guys, smoked it. I think there's going to be a ton of them over here. Then we're going to switch up to a little Texas rig. See if we can get that bite going. I just want to catch some fish. I don't care if they're big right now. We don't really care about size. But that's my first official fish on the new setup. Oh, I'm falling down. Nice little slow mo release. See you, dude. Let's go get some more. We got another one. Flips right in here. Stay on. Got him. There he is. I like the setup so much. So sick. Oh, he just sprayed me. Jeez. Told you guys they would be up in this stuff. Super chunky fish. Nice little guy. I'm gonna take it. See you, bro. Let's go, baby. All right, so this is the Lose Tournament XP right here. Basically similar to most other bait casters. You got your tension knob, your settings and stuff. Seven five to one gear ratio. So it's kind of a pretty fast reel. That's how I like it. I don't like slow fishing out in the middle like that kind of stuff. I like just fast moving baits, you know? So we're just gonna keep throwing this around. Oh, there was another carp. Cast really smooth. I just gotta, oh my God, did you guys see that? Like 50 fish just came off the bank. Do I got one? Yeah, I do got one. Hello? We're on. Wait, buddy. Buddy, I can't tell if that's a fish. Oh, that is a fish. Got him. Running at us. Stay on there. Oh, we got off right there. No. All right, you know what? We're going to go ahead and switch up to that little Texas shake. And then switch back up when we get to the other pipes. I feel like fishing Sanko right now. I always like to use a 5 aught hook. I don't know why. 5 aught extra wide gap. That's just always been my go-to. I don't really care. But I just feel like I have a better hookup ratio with a bigger hook. So all you want to do is just slide your bait up just like that. And then you just come around right in the little slot. Make sure that's right there. I'm not going to make this weedless right now, but you can slide that hook point right under to make it weedless. Oh, there's a bash right there. Perfect. I saw something busting. Let's see. Oh, buddy. He's trying to eat the Sanko. But he's got it. Oh, you see that? These are like little tiny guys. Come on. See, come back for it. Oh, he's trying to eat it. I want to catch this fish so bad. Get up here. Yes. He literally just bit the end of the hook. No, no. Get over here. Come on. Oh, we got a cicada too. We do not like cicadas. 10 pounder right there. Nice little guy. See you, dude. Yes, sir. Another super tiny one. Just got him. No. Got off right there. They're literally just biting onto the end of it. That's so funny. Come on. Where are these bigger fish at? Anyone on the drain right here? We'll find out. Spooked another one off. It had better size to it. Unfortunately. Whoops. Right over here. We got one. Oh, he dropped it. Hello? He dropped it. All right, so if you guys go ahead and take a look at this, I'm gonna switch back up to the jig, like I said, because it's a ton of duckweed back here, whatever it is. And these fish keep blowing up on insects back here. Some nice, oh, you see that? Yeah, 
They're just blowing up on stuff, like I said. There's one. Oh, uh, yeah. I saw some, yeah. Got him. There he is. On the old joggy jig, there we go. Drilled it. Ready for this Pro Bassmaster part six? Got him. See you, guy. All right, so we're standing on this like drain right now. We're gonna try to catch a fish out of this. I'm not sure if there's one back here, but I used to always flip under here, get smacked like way back in the drain. Oh, there was a bass. Just came out. All right. Let's see if we can get one to come out of here. About to slip into this drain. Come on. Yep, yep, what I say. That was such a bad hook set. Oh, that's a nice fish. Stay on there. Biggest fish of the day. In the drain. Let's go, baby. That was such a weird hook set. <laughs> Solid one. We will take you all day, buddy. On the bandito bug and jig. Drilled it. That fish will go about a pound. Chunker. Let's go ahead and hook this guy. Oh, buddy, chill. All right, yo, 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 what are we doing? Can we not do that? There we go. There we go. Nice fish. Oh, one just came out of the boat that's right there. See you, guy. Let's go, baby. Let's get some more. Guys, another pretty big fish came up and smoked the jig. This one is bigger than the last one. That was so cool. I wasn't recording for the cast. He's just taking it out. Please stay on, fish. Done. That's a really nice one. No! Did you guys see that? That was a two and a half pounder all day. How did he come off, dude? Dang it. He came up and drilled it out of nowhere from under this tree. Oh, it was so sick. All right, let's see. We got fish here. Anyone else home? I forgot to mention, this rod is a seven foot one medium power. I really like it. I think this combo looks cool together. Everything's super smooth. We're able to catch a ton of fish on it today. All right, so I'm about to head out, go film another video at another spot. Thank you all for watching. I definitely really like both the reel and the rod. The reel casts super well. You guys are definitely gonna be seeing me using that a lot. We're actually going to Florida, back to the place where I filmed my Florida series in about 10 days. I'm super pumped. We're gonna absolutely slay out. We're gonna catch a bunch of giant fish, epic B-roll. So I really hope you guys stay tuned for all of that. But yeah. I'm about to head out. Thank you all for watching. I'll catch you next time.